Well, when you think of award-winning barbecue, people often think of Texas. But one local company is not only comp competing, but winning competitions in the Lone Star State. That's right. Wingalings is made right here in Central New York, but it's making a name for itself nationally. And Shannon Stoddard is the man behind it, and he joins us this morning with more. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So you guys just came back recently from Texas, right? Yeah, we came back from Texas. And uh, you came back with a nice little award, right? Yeah, yeah we entered our product, our uh, blackened seasoning, mm -hmm. in one first place in the seafood category wow. with our blackened seasoning, mm -hmm. which was, um, the winning wasn't by design, but the product that we entered was because, mm -hmm. because it gives us a southern base, um, like a southern exposure yeah. for mm -hmm. Florida. I mean, everything's Black and group, or black and this, black and that, because they're trying to build the brand to be a national brand. Mm -hmm. What yeah. I want to know is what sets your your like wingalings apart from those southern brands, because you think about going to you know Texas or mm -hmm. the southern states, and they're known right. for that. So how did you compete? Well, when we we send in the product and they cook with it, mm -hmm. we tell them what we want them to make with it. They cook the food, they put it in front of judges. Mm that have no idea what they're tasting. They taste it and they and they make their decision. Wow. So, you know, there's thousands of people at these events that mm -hmm. are, you know, peers of ours that are entering products. Mm -hmm. So we don't really know what it is that, that made them choose us other than the fact that it is very unique, it's low salt, it works good on the food. When you're trying to truly blacken something, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it has to be able to crust on and stick to the fish or stick right. to the shrimp or whatever you're trying the scallops that you're trying to cook with mm, and it's amazing he it's healthier in the sense that it's not uh, there isn't as much salt in the product as maybe others right. might have all right of our, all, all of our products all yeah. Are like that. yeah yeah, yeah. That's, right. our, that's part of our business model is to be lower salt and less salt so you're not buying expensive salt you're buying spice so this is the award here for this, right? And then you you brought home a few ribbons too. We yeah, talk about those. you know, you third know. place. But hey, what hey, are you gonna do, right? Hey, that's a bronze <laughs> in the Olympics. <laughs> yeah, so we um we won for our logo okay. overall, mm -hmm. the Winglings yeah. chicken uh -huh. and the Winglings <laughs> logo. Yes. Um, do you kind get a of name for that his, chicken? Yeah. Well, we really don't. We've been told he should have a name, <laughs> he but I think have a name. I think everybody's been calling him Shannon. Oh, Shannon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think so. So he was modeled after you know the business and after myself and mm -hmm. and we were actually myself and Eddie Dean, who's the largest caterer in Texas. Mm -hmm. He does like fifteen thousand person caterings for George Bush and this type yeah. of stuff. Yeah. Him and I were the only two there with cowboy hats on. Wow! I was really shocked. I thought there'd be more cowboys in yeah. Texas than there really was, but <laughs> it was just me and Eddie. So um, okay, so then you, you really quick you you also won for your uh, that's a drink enhancer. Yeah, so a it's a it. rimmer for the top of a Bloody Mary. Yep, we've you know, had that. It's delicious. Yeah, it we go delicious. to some of the local bars, and it's funny when you walk in, you see them using your stuff on the product. It's, it's awesome. kind of fun. Yeah. Now, and you also sort of do this. You, people can do this as fundraising efforts, right? Or or you can yes. purchase it on your website. This as is well. our trio box, mm -hmm. and that trio box is put out there as a way for us to give back to the community. Mm -hmm. Um, we're carrying it in some of the stores and we're like featuring it in stores but the main goal for the the trio box is to put it out there as a local product that you can use as your fundraiser mm -hmm. we're giving back 30 percent Wow. Oh, great. Okay. That's great. So we think we're giving back a substantial amount. Mm -hmm. um, there's a recipe in the box on how to use it mm -hmm. and let's face it it puts you in people's homes mm -hmm. so you know and when then you you're go buying out something and do, you can use. Yeah. You're buying That's something you I can like, use. You know? I mean it's something different. It's yeah. not candy bars. It's not, you know, it's just yeah, something something, something new. Yeah. Right. It's so, awesome. I mean, all that stuff is good, and it's all good that they're giving back, but this is our rendition of that. Great. Well, listen, if you'd like more information, maybe to get in on that fundraising effort uh, with your school or program, or you'd just like to know more, or maybe pick up some of this Wingling Spice Rub, you can visit spiceitupsome.com. <laughs>